Heather from Strings and Threads. Welcome and thank you so much for being here. For those of you who have been with me for a long time, you can remember that it might have been a little bit less than a year ago I started a project that I was calling Band Buddies. That's not what I ultimately ended up naming it, but I just kept calling it that. And it has been a long project that I've been working on. My sons are both in the marching band and I thought it would be cute to make little Amigurumi marching band characters. And so I came up with a book where there's a design for a pattern for the body and then for the uniform and you can customize the colors how you want. And then there's each instrument is also a pattern in the book and uh, even the color guard is in there. So it took a long time and each pattern has a video tutorial. You may have noticed that those started popping up. I didn't just make those videos. What had happened was as I was creating the patterns, I was also doing a video tutorial of how to make them, thinking that when I published the book, I would put the link in there and people could follow the link and watch it. And so I set it up on my YouTube account as a link only video. So even these videos had been posted since September, October, November, as I was going through making all of the patterns, but they were could only be seen if you knew the link. So I had a pattern tester who was make who was doing the patterns and she would try to uh, type the link in and it would say you cannot access this link it's private if i texted her or emailed the link she could click on it and get right in but just typing the link in did not get her into it and so that was a little bit frustrating to me because i was hoping those links could be something that was exclusive to the people who bought the pattern but it is not meant to be like that. So if somebody wanted to get the pattern and not buy the book, you know, you can watch my video tutorials. <laughs> but know that the a whole lot of work went into those. This was such a long project for me. Here's an example of one. So this would be the basic band dude. I have this one playing the trumpet and this one with a blonde haired wig. There's multiple wig patterns. And these are the colors I chose for the uniform. But like I said, you can customize. The bodies for all of them are about the same, but you can customize which instrument you give them, you know, what color you want every part of this to be. So uh, that's the band guy holding his trumpet, but he could be holding a flute, a saxophone, a tuba, a trombone, all of those instruments are included in the pattern book. And then there is a color guard, Amigurumi, that, that goes in there too. And there's um, a pattern for her. I didn't attach this on both sides because I thought, oh, it makes it hard for you to really see what she looks like when I have the flag right in front of her. But here's how she looks and she has some wig options and the costume can be customized to the color that you want. The, um, you know, the color of anything can be adjusted. This is just the example that I did. And then all, her, she comes with a pattern for a flag and for a baton and for a rifle. And finally, the book was published. I have a copy here, but I have some more publishers copies on order. And when they come in, I will do a giveaway for a few of those. So here's how they look. Marching Band Amigurumi is what I called it, crochet patterns. And there's 21 patterns in there. Um, you know, like here's an example of a bass drum. Here's the saxophone, the clarinet. Um, here are different wigs. There's a long haired wig. Uh, you know, and then directions and a link to the video tutorial, which you can type in now and access because the video tutorials are public. 
So, and then I put in there, I made these with crochet thread, but it's only a suggestion to use crochet thread. You can make it with any type of yarn. You could follow the pattern with any type of yarn. It, the size will basically be what gets affected by that. And if you were curious, uh, the back has some information on it, but this is a picture of me when I was in marching band in high school. I played the piccolo in the marching band. <laughs> there is a pattern for a piccolo in there. So I'm going to do the same offer as last time. I am not starting the physical book giveaway yet because I just have the one copy. Uh, but like I said, the other ones are, are on order. They're a little bit slower to get here because publishers' copies are sent at copy cost. So the Whatever the cost is for them to print the book is what I what I get charged. Uh, but they're not in a rush to print those out. They'll print out the ones that people are paying full price for first. So it might be, you know, a couple weeks. It could be next week. It could be three weeks when those come in. If you're a creator, a content creator, I'm going to have the same offer and you're willing to show something from this book. Now know that this is a little bit more labor intensive patterns than my uh, dice bags were. Uh, but if you are interested in this, I would be happy and I can start that right away. Just shoot me an email. I'd be happy to send you a digital copy of the book if in exchange for you making uh, one of the amigurumi from the book and showing it on your channel. I don't mind the size of your channel. Some people contacted me when I had this offer with the um, dice bags. You know, they're saying, oh, I only have, you know, 60 subscribers and I really was hoping I could do this. I was like, that's perfectly fine. I don't have any kind of criteria about how many subscribers you have or how long you've been on YouTube. It would be amazing if somebody who had a big channel wanted to show it, but I'm not expecting that. People with large channels are not watching me. So uh, I'm happy for anyone who would be wanting to show how this would look. And you can make it in any yarn. If you made any kind of adaptations, go ahead and you know talk about those. I'm perfectly fine with that. So if you're a content creator, no matter how many subscribers you have, uh, just shoot me an email. It's in, My email's in the description below and I'll send you a digital copy of the book. And I certainly would not expect like tomorrow you'd have one made or, you know, even four or five days or a week, one would be made. It might take a, more time than that. And that's perfectly fine. But I would just ask that in exchange for a free copy of this, that you would show it on your channel. I thank you for watching this video. I hope everybody has a great day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.